Hi friends, Sparklet here again. This is my seventh film about Norway. We continue driving in the electric vehicle on the scenic road number seven. In this film, our shopping and hotel experience, exploring nature with rocks and sheep, and strange berries. I couldn't find on the internet what they are. Maybe Norwegians can help me. This is a kiwi chain, Agnes had told us that here we can buy some water and maybe some snacks for the road and we are going to do so. Selection of apples like Argentina, Italy, but we decided to have Nor Norwegian. Yeah. Norwegian? Yeah, I see this particular one. Let's pick up some of them. This, this. <laughs> How many? Four? Oh, yeah, four is good. Four is good or five? They look good. Let's take five. Okay. Okay. They have the needles. And if you wanna fill the price, you should divide with them for the euros what dollars. And if it's 39, it means uh, 390. Four bucks. Strawberries 59 means 599 or six bucks a small box. Big sound. The bread, we yeah, think we might like it. Yeah, and uh, this is like 39 Norwegian crowns. That means around $4 for euros. Yeah. Let's take it. Let's take it. For Americans, I would like to explain that the price here is not per pound, but per kilo, which is about two pounds. Oh, I don't mind. I like tomatoes, you don't. Okay, get tomatoes. Okay, I think we can take those. Because we don't have a refrigerator. No. <laughs> Let's get this. Yeah, what is that? It's a Norwegian sausage. Okay, this one? Yeah. Is five bucks. Five bucks? That's a pretty good deal, I think. L l look what type of sausage oh, wait, is maybe, it? Maybe these are the five dollar ones. I don't know. I don't know either. But uh, what is it's a beef or? No idea. What we bought? Food. Some snacks. Got some salamis or something. Norwegian. Bread. Norwegian bread. Norwegian spread. Yeah. Norwegian cheese. <laughs> Norwegian. Norwegian apples. Yeah. We're becoming Norwegian. Taste a little bit something local. Well, we have got our stuff to have them on the road. Okay, Do not 
the region can. <laughs> Do not spend time because we, we have quite a long trip. We just push the button and it closes. And it closes. Great. <laughs> I love this car. I feel like driving a car better than a Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> Swedish, Swedish, Swedish Electric. Polestar. Polestar. I never even heard of it, but it's a very cool car and it looks good and it drives excellent. Oh man, I love it. It's comfortable. Snow in the snow in the distance. What was that? You look how beautiful the rock is here. And plant is growing over the rock. You know, kind of oh, that's like very a beautiful. Beautiful colored lichen. Yeah, that's very, very beautiful colors. So we decided to check this place because it's not only beautiful and people are camping there, it's colorful, but also it has very interesting rocks here. It's heavy, but I'll never find another rock like this. So I'm going to film it for you. I think I'm going to try to take it home. To remember. No, I'm going to try to take it home. No. Yeah. <laughs> thinking that I'm gonna take a rock for him in my luggage to Riga. Look how beautiful that rock is. I understand, but uh, but uh, they will put me in prison. You know what, we could use this for a candle holder. That's definitely we could, but just don't be so attached to it. Leave it here for you to come next time. <laughs> Goats. 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 Oh my gosh. Oh, they're really people are going slow because the goats are here. Pick the, them. pick the berries. Huh? Come to watch. What berries are these? But so many of them. Should be some edible. Nice. Should I try uh, to eat? I don't know. I would I would look it up first on uh, the internet. <laughs> look. Maybe they are healthy. They look good. <laughs> yeah. Probably the sheep are eating. You don't see them. You see just the red leaves. You see the field like that. What did you find there? It's an interesting white plant that we saw that's like cotton. You did, did you take seeds? 
I took the seats. I'm looking for rocks. Oh. We stopped just in the middle of, of the freeway. It's so beautiful. And those snow poles on the road. So going to? Driving to? We're going. To where? Uh, well, if you don't get in the car, you won't know where. <laughs> <laughs> Oslo. And guess what? On the way back to Oslo, we stopped at the place where he threw out his rock and picked it up. This rock is very interesting. Look, it's just a regular rock, but it's split right in two. And there's this dark mineralization right there, kind of like a crystal. I don't know. I might take that rock home. Yeah. You, you have luggage of 10 kilos. I have to kilos. carry it with me on a plane. <laughs> <In> my jacket. <laughs> to London. <laughs> We are flying to London from Oslo and from London to Riga. That's like a uh, a glass of volcanic. I came back to get my rock. Okay, he threw out it first. Just anyway. because she made me. I came back for it. <laughs> what do you do? What are you gonna do? I'm taking it home. Oh my gosh. From this place. One of the roads back was closed, the navigator took us to the different road, extending our trip for a couple of hours. We had to take a stop and have a short rest. Nobody was waiting us at the reception. Everything was automated and we have got in very fast. 335, third floor. We are taking elevator. Coffee. We're done the drinking eating tonight. Yes, that's true. No, <laughs> coffee we still can have our tea. Yeah, but it'll keep you awake at night. There's, you know, in the morning, that's when you can have coffee. Okay. Not at night before you go to bed. See, we are in the harbor. Our apartment is just in the beautiful right place. here. Yes. Surrounded by water. Three, two. We should go here. Okay. This is our Perfect. tiny small apartment. Perfect. For one night. Yes. Everything is here. Nice. Basic things. Yes. Love it. Suitcase here. We got a good. Place. So we are staying one night. 100 bucks apartment it's amazing. night. Yes. Very nice, but close. Prepare it. You don't pay in this one additionally, because in previous one, we paid additionally for the yes, we did. bedding. This is very nice, because we have very nicely designed the small shower room with a fa with a hair dryer oh, and, and, hair dryer. and wow. soap and you know glasses in this okay and very fancy the most fancy is that here is the shower oh. but here is also the toilet it's very tiny small but i think it's, it's very, all we need yeah all we need for a few hours of stay yep. thank you guys we like it yeah Ha, <laughs> ha,
<laughs> I will, uh, so we miss another at least five days of the stay, correct? Yeah. So we are getting to the airport. I'm flying to Riga with the rock which Mick picked uh, in my luggage. I hope it goes smoothly. And Mick is flying to London because uh, by the immigration law of Schengen, he cannot spend more than 90 days in uh, the European Union and he has to cross the border. I hope in the evening we both meet in Riga. Yeah, I'm going back to the uh, drop off the car. Okay, and I'm here in the station. All right, station. I'll be right back. Okay, safety flight to London if I don't see you. Yeah, thank you. And see you tonight in Riga. Okay, I mean... Bye. Like and subscribe to my channel. There will be one final film about our trip to Norway. Your Sparklet.